we've been waiting for this day for a long time. It's opening day in the NBA. Thanks, everyone, for joining us here in the start of a new season. I'm Kevin Harlan, joined by the talented analyst tandem of Greg Anthony and Chris Weber. David Aldridge is on our sideline. We've got the law, and nothing tips off a broadcast. Thanks very much. Well, unusual circumstances for AI. This opening night is just the second regular season game he's ever played. Now, AI said he's looking forward to being part of the process this time from the very beginning. And after what he had to deal with last year, that makes sense. Kevin? Thank you for that, David. You think back to when AI made his debut at the end of last season. Just a whirlwind of time for him, guys. I mean, it must have felt like being dropped onto a moving treadmill. I mean, and being asked to keep pace. I mean, I'm sure AI will appreciate having a more typical start to his first full NBA season. Two conference rivals, C. Webb, squaring off tonight. All right, let's start this extra. first game. You can feel it riding on this one. Oh, yeah, and you know how the conference rival games go. These games can mean a lot at the end of the season when you're talking about... Norkic in the post, guarded by McGee, and good that time. Lillard's okay. got five got points this. so far. The consistency of Lillard with his consistent probing on the defense, he's become Mr. Reliable at a very young age. Harris outside. Up top, Kuzma. James right side. Over Turner. Out to Kuzma. Just two to shoot. Bad shot, my boy. missing. Trailblazers leading by four. Turner passes to Lillard, and Lillard right, is going to pick up a foul. That is his first foul of the game. Lakers have gotten three of eight shots to fall for them here in the first quarter. Right wing. And McGee kicks to AI. Sinks the 15-footer. AI's got his first bucket in this one. And just looking back at AI and how he started his NBA career, what a way to make an entrance into the league in a pressure-packed situation, Greg, like this. Yeah, and a lot of players would have been overwhelmed, but AI was instrumental in, in getting the win and helping the team secure a playoff berth. What an incredible moment it was for him <laughs> in an NBA that. debut. McCollum outside to the left wing. And Aminu kicks to McCollum. Here's Lillard. The putback. It's good on the putback. And good luck trying to keep Nurkic off the glass. I mean, using his brute strength well on the offensive board. Kuzma with a screen on Lillard. Knocked and away. White. Stolen by Please. McCollum. And stolen by LeBron. Here's AI. Los Angeles with another miss. His percentage from the field is not very strong this quarter. To the inside, Lillard. That ball. Nice feed okay. that time from Turner. Right. And it's seven points for Lillard. A three for four to start. I mean, he's going to try to keep this streak going as long as he can. But just watching the progression of C.J. McCollum, year to year has been astonishing. I mean... He came into the NBA with little fanfare, but now he's one of the league's top shooting guards. Leonard, he's checked in for the Trailblazers. Reese Harkless comes in for Turner. And the Lakers also making a switch. Ingram's checked in. Two points. That one goes. Not Good. settling. Yeah. Ingram uses his size and athleticism getting to the paint. And with McCollum, he is the complete package on the offensive end. I mean, he can take any defender one-on-one, -on -one, and with a little bit of space, he can take over the game. He's a great shooter and fantastic facilitator. I mean, you ask around the league, they'll tell you that McCullum is one of the toughest guys to guard in the game. For the Trailblazers, Nick Stauskas is checked in for Aminu, and Curry subbed in for... McGee sets the pick for AI. And the whistle blows. It's going to be on Damian Lillard. That's his third foul of the game. Kuzma against Aminu. Kuzma kicks the ball. Kuzma sets a screen. 
Ball, the pass to Kuzma. Five to shoot. Here's AI. Give shots it's in that phone. Be out of bounds. The Trailblazers will take it. And now, here's the 2K leaderboard with the teams that last season scored the most second chance points in the NBA. The Lakers second. This was a team that was really savvy when it came to getting positioned under the boards and then getting those offensive putbacks. Taking a look at Los Angeles, LeBron and Kuzma make up the forwards. AI is out there with Lonzo Ball, and it's McGee in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. Offensive rebound. Give me that. Nurkic can't hit. Wow, he just does everything right there except hit the layup. Fires the three, and AI go. with the basket on the Finally assist by Ball. Ball. AI's got five points so far. Portland's gone one of four from three-point range in the second. Not a whole lot dropping out there for them. And a deep three from Lillard. Yeah, okay. Bangs yeah, on the trifecta. Playing. He's got ten. And at the offensive end, he's done about as much as they could have hoped for today. And the Lakers a few years ago were at the bottom of the league. Their rebuild didn't take long at all. Smart trades and good draft picks have been the trademark of this franchise turnaround. This one on the play. <laughs> Bucket's good. He'll go okay. to the line. Look at the energy Lillard plays with. He doesn't give in to the defense. He's superb at scoring despite the hit. Oh, Harris has checked in for Lonzo Ball. Lakers trail by eight. AI. It's good. Only too. a few seconds into the shot clock. AI's got five points now in the quarter. Yeah, I'm surprised that D isn't respecting his mid-range game more. Uh, they ought to be. I, I bet you they will be soon. Turner passes to Lillard. Good work there as it goes. Lillard's got the lead up to eight now for the Trailblazers. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. Here's AI. Again, the Lakers. Yeah, they've raised their shooting percentage in this quarter, and they're starting to get oh. on track. The Trailblazers have gone 5 of 12 from the field here in the second. Inside, it's tipped, and it's out of bounds to Portland. They'll retain possession. And a look now at the four areas where shots can come from. The paint, mid-range, and shots from deep all broken down for Los Angeles. And this is a team that is so comfortable with that mid-range jump shot. There are a lot of folks who would say that's living dangerously, that it's a bad idea to rely on those 10 to 20 footers, but they've got players with the talent to knock those down consistently. And again, like Los that. Angeles with the triple. He's wrapped up his game in a big way this quarter. I don't think he likes it when they're trailing. Trailblazers leading by three. Lillard outside. Let's it go with a three. Mm. Slides through for his seventh basket in 11 tries. Uh, okay, well, he got a nice little back and forth going here. And I love it, Greg. Both sides inflicting damage from the perimeter. We'll see how the defense is adjusted. Los Angeles calls timeout. And what a draft day steal for the Lakers, who were able to get Kyle Kuzma, who had been drafted 27th overall. Yeah, Kuzma came into the league far more polished than anyone expected and you have to credit the young man's hard work and how he was able to make such a big splash that rookie year and, and with how hard he works Kuzma is going to be an impactful player in this Please league for back a long there. time all right let's catch up with our sideline reporter David Alder okay. well guys Kyle Kuzma had a tough upbringing in Flint Michigan he said they had the recession lead in the water it was like an urban war zone. We probably moved 14 times before I was 16. Basketball was my key. And his drive to succeed in the NBA yeah. was born of a desire to escape that environment. Kevin? A tremendous work ethic, David. Thank you. Good on that shot. And with that, the Trailblazer lead is cut down to just four points in the bucket from Harris. Portland's gone for the three-pointer seven times here in the second and been successful three times. Here's the screen. Lillard with no one around. That three off the mark. And I thought that was going to drop. It looked good from here. The shot and game clock separated by four. AI, no good. Trailblazers leading by four. Let's it go from deep. And Damian Lillard with the bucket on the assist by Turner. Turner's got three assists tonight. Now, AI. 
12 points for him. McGee is screen on Lillard. Just three on the clock. Again, Los Angeles. Effective screen set there for the jump shot. That was the key to the play. And the first half comes to a conclusion in a game that has been very close so far. But it's the Trailblazers game, yeah. up by five. Thanks so much, Dave, for the great interview. Don't go away, folks. We'll be back for the second half of basketball right after this. Well, both sides have assessed what they need to do over the break in halftime. We'll see now if one can pull out a win. He's checked in for Damian Lillard. Right, well, Big group substitution here for the Lakers. Michael Beasley, he's checked in for JaVale McGee. Ingram comes in for James. Contavious Caldwell Pope, he's checked in for Harris. And AI subbed in for Ball. At the two, it's McCullough with Turner at the three. Al Farouk Amino is out there with Nurkic, and it's Curry in at the point guard position. That's the group on the floor for Portland. McCollum kicks to Curry. Screen by Nurkic. Curry passes to Nurkic. McCollum outside. He nails it, and we're tied up. McCollum's got 12 points in the game. And you can see the play calling this half. Another one from distance. Well, that's because they made a concerted effort yeah, to get the shooters involved. Now they've yeah. built up the confidence. Turner against Ingram. For the lead, some solid defense from Ingram. About three seconds between shot and game clock. Caldwell Pope on the wing. 15 seconds left in the third quarter, and the Lakers tack on two more. Uh, I love the form that Caldwell Pope has when he's open in the mid-range. He feels comfortable rising up from there. Outside Curry. With one on the clock, and he got the whistle, so he'll have a three-point play opportunity. And finally, they fought themselves back to even the score. We've got a new ball game here now. They've shown some character tonight. There was no quit in right, so Even when up. they were down feet. It's all tied in Portland. Don't go anywhere. The final quarter is coming up next. Yeah, on. And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist of the game. And the definition of teamwork right there, guys. I mean, what great communication between them and what a beautiful feed. I mean, well, if you're the coaching staff, I mean, you're pumped up. This highlight will not only make it on the TV, it'll make it into the film session tomorrow. All right, we welcome you back to what's been a hard-fought battle. Fourth quarter should be good. So the Lakers five right now. Ingram and Kuzma filling up the three and the four. Harris is out there with AI. And it's Beasley in at the five spot. Last year was a season of up and down for the Blazers. I mean, when you think about it, they won their division title for just the second time since 2000. Third overall in the West, but were blindsided by the Pelicans and swept in the first round. McCollum against Harris. McCollum outside to take the lead. Bullseye! McCollum's okay. got the first points up on the board here in the fourth for the Trailblazers. And that first round exit for the Blazers really overshadowed Chris the good they accomplished in the regular season. Uh, and that's a shame because they had a fantastic year overall as a group. I mean, they had a late season surge in March to secure the division and, and third in the West. Uh, they don't necessarily have the talent of other teams. They're in a small market, but those are the breaks uh, in the NBA. I'm sure this group will be out with a chip on their shoulder because of it. Six on the shot clock. No okay. one near Curry okay. as he lets it go. That ball, nice feed that time from McCollum. They're, they're getting a lot of their points outside the paint. Three of their last five baskets are from three-point range. Dude, AI dishes to Beasley. Shoots over Curry. That oh, one's in there. The Trailblazer lead is cut down to just one on the bucket from Beasley. And boy, did he ever sell the pump fake. Worked to absolute perfection. Screen by Nurkic. Down low. Over Beasley. Oh, and that one had the right spit on it, and it is good. And 11 points for Nurkic. 
Uh, uh, yeah, Kevin, great court awareness from the crafty guard McCullum. I mean, a good teammate who likes hitting his open guys. Ingram. Yes, once again, it remains perfect. Six attempts and six hits. This team really feeds off of one another in terms of their energy. Yeah, yeah, it's taking on a different feel since the break. You can see how many more hustle plays are being made. And it's Turner off the drive. And Nurkic has it in the corner. And Aminu kicks to Turner. Screen by Nurkic. Again, the Trailblazers score. Oh, well, Turner's crafty in the pick and roll. Once the screens come, he's good at assessing the defense and breaking them down. Turner against Ingram. Back to AI. Oh, man. My shot Rebound by Nurkic. Man, right play, wrong result on that one. Generally, you knock those down. Well, I, I like the decision making, though. I mean, that's a shot you want to keep taking. Kuzma passes to AI. To the inside, out to Kuzma. Beasley dishes to AI. Okay, Around nope. three minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. Trailblazers leading by three. To the middle, here's yes. Turner. That ball, nice feed that time from McCollum. McCollum's got his fourth assist minutes, with that last one here tonight. Los Angeles calls timeout. And really, whether you're up or down, it's a game of adjustments. Well, yeah, he might have seen something he wants to exploit. But we'll see what they run coming out of this. And now we get the chance to present our Jordan player. And so the Lakers take okay. the win. A truly yes, gutsy performance away from home. You know, it, it really was. And Kevin, when this one was hanging in the balance late, they showed just what a tough-minded group they can be. And that'll do it for the first game of the NBA season. For Chris Webber, Greg Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is... We've got an interview request for you. Come with me. Oh, yeah? Okay. AI, Griff Bryant, thanks for talking with me. Great game tonight. Uh, yeah, uh, thank you, yeah. of course. So, uh, considering this was just your first game, I'd say you held your own. How did it feel to contribute right away? Oh, man, um, you know, it was great. You know, my teammates been really amazing, just helpful, giving me advice on whatever the NBA is going to throw at me. And, uh, you know, it, it makes me uh, looking forward to contribute to whatever I can do, you know, even just a little bit. After college, you spent some time in China and then in the G League. The NBA must feel like a whole new world. Uh, you know, sort of. Like, we still playing basketball, and I was still part of a team, you know, like I was in Shanghai and, and Fort Wayne. Um, my time in both those places taught me a lot about what it means to be a teammate, and I just look forward to using that knowledge to help us get some Ws. That's refreshing to hear from someone who just finished their first game of the season. Listen, thanks again, AI, and congrats on the strong debut. Thank you. Thanks, Griff. AI, you're good to go. All right, man. 